In this video, I want to show you a great web resource that will really help you organize your meetings, uh, help getting people together, family events, and generally to find out when is good. So if you go to whenisgood.net, you'll be greeted with this homepage and you can get started right away. And it gives you a bunch of options here. What I'm going to recommend is to get an account because there's so much uh, options that they give you with this account. So let's get an account. I'm gonna sign up. And when I sign up, it'll send me a confirmation email. I click on that and I can log in. So once I log in, I'm greeted with this and I want to create a new event. So here we go. Here's all the options in this box. I can show options and let's choose some options here. I want this the 16th through the 23rd. I only want weekdays and here's the hours that I want uh, available. I can put some text in for there. I can even sync it with my iCal and some different options. All right, so let's update the grid. It only gives me these days. All right, now if I wanted to, I could do multiple weeks. Here's going into March. There we go. So first thing I'm going to do is name this event. And I want to uh, tell the people when I'm available. So maybe here on Tuesday, it's most of the day. Wednesday, it's a little bit of the morning and at four o'clock. Thursday for me, it's actually no good. Friday, all afternoon. Then that Monday, I'm actually good most of the day. Tuesday, just a couple hours here and there. Thursday, Friday, and so if I'm actually available these days, um, it'll help in the long run. So once I click create event, here we go. Here's the actual web address where it's available. I can send this link to whoever I want, and I want to get alerts when somebody responds. So I can email right in here, and so here's what it loads up for this meeting date. It already says, hi, I'm organizing this event. I'd like to find out your availability. This link will show you my proposed times and then they can click on that link. So all I have to do is fill in the box for different uh, people that I know. So here I go. And I click send. And it's been sent to all those people. So this is what somebody will see when they get the email and you can customize this uh, email as much as you want. So when they click on this link, it'll take them to this availability and maybe they're just available here, 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 and they just fill in their own availability. So they can click on that. They can type in whatever they want. And that'll send a response to uh, whoever created the page, whoever created the uh, when is good page. And let's say this is the uh, email to a second person and they go in and they fill out uh, their availability. They don't have as much here. So their name is Mary and she sends it in. So let's go to your account and this is where it'll tell me uh, the different details. Okay, so here is where the two responses are and here is where here is where it actually shows you the possible meeting times for when is good for everybody. Okay, so you see 10 a.m. on the 16th. Uh, 3 p.m. and these are in green. Now if I want to go and just look at John's, here is when he is available. If I want to look at Mary's, that's when she's available. And then everything else is when I'm available. Okay, so 
there's my possibilities. It gives me a couple dates of when is good for everyone. So there you go. When is good is a great website to show you, obviously, when is good for meeting times, for gatherings, for get togethers, family events, corporate meetings, anything you need. So try out when is good at whenisgood.net.